Glomerulonephritis refers to inflammation of the glomeruli, the kidney structures responsible for filtering waste and excess fluids from the blood and producing urine. The condition can be acute, occurring suddenly, or chronic, developing gradually over time. Common signs and symptoms include hematuria, proteinuria, oliguria, hypertension, edema, anemia, confusion, nausea, vomiting, muscle weakness, pallor, and pruritus. Glomerulonephritis often involves an immune response triggered by a streptococcal bacterial infection, where the person's antibodies mistakenly attack the kidney glomeruli. This immune response leads to inflammation and damage to the glomeruli, affecting their ability to filter waste and fluids properly. Other causes include viral infections, certain medications, toxins, and autoimmune diseases like systemic lupus erythematosus and vasculitis. Potential complications of glomerulonephritis include worsening kidney function, severe hypertension, and fluid overload. Diagnostic tests for glomerulonephritis typically show increased BUN and creatinine levels, decreased GFR and potassium, phosphorus and calcium imbalances. Complete blood counts are monitored for anemia that can be caused by decreased erythropoietin production. A urinalysis is often performed to assess for infection, and a kidney biopsy may be performed to determine the underlying cause. Imaging studies like CT and renal ultrasound may also be performed to identify structural abnormalities. Common medications prescribed for glomerulonephritis include antibiotics to treat bacterial infections, immunosuppressants to reduce inflammation caused by an autoimmune response, diuretics to manage fluid overload, and antihypertensives to control blood pressure and prevent further kidney damage. Dialysis may be necessary if acute kidney failure occurs to restore fluid and electrolyte balance. Plasmapheresis may be performed to remove excessive antibodies or immune complexes. Priority nursing interventions involve managing infection, preventing complications, and providing health teaching. Nurses monitor vital signs for signs of infection, administer prescribed antibiotics, and educate patients and caregivers on infection control practices. Daily weights, fluid intake and output, and blood pressure are monitored for signs of fluid imbalances. Health teaching includes instructions on medication adherence, dietary restrictions, recognizing symptoms of worsening kidney function, and the importance of follow-up appointments. Patient education focuses on the causes and treatment of glomerulonephritis, the importance of adhering to medication regimens, managing protein intake, and recognizing signs of deteriorating kidney function. Teaching about lifestyle modifications and dietary restrictions can help clients self-manage their condition and prevent complications. When evaluating nursing interventions, overall goals include reducing fluid retention, improving urinary output, ensuring patient understanding of the condition and treatment, and monitoring for complications. Effective nursing care aims to manage symptoms, treat underlying causes, and support patients in maintaining their overall health and well-being.